So here we are. I've been talking about a TV show forever. So this is it. Rush Springs Ranch, show and go. We got an off-road park here, and we have a portable sawmill that comes in and cuts our own lumber for building cabins. And we've got some horses, kind of a hobby. We do some riding. We're building an inland marina, a bunch of boats for cabins. And we're just having a great time. So we're gonna show a little bit of what we do at each show. We fix up vehicles. How do you like my big uh, military stuff? We're putting some wood on the back there so I can haul lumber, take it on and off with the forklift. Down there, we're turning that old trailer into a cabin. Let's uh, drive around, take a look and see what we got going on. Here's our newest invention, Russ Springs Ranch. He come up with the idea of putting a storage building on five foot stem walls, which was made our levels staggered. So we have four levels in here and they're staggered. Uh, we have the the bathrooms, shower room, and we have six bedrooms. No, nope. pimping it out. Here's Bo. How's it going in here? It's going. It's going. It's getting a little hot, a little cramped, but it's going. Starting to look pretty good. What do we got going in here? A little bathroom. What do we have? Yeah, we got shower door? stuff here. All rough cut lumber. We got a vanity we made here. The shower pan. The door that goes in the vanity. All cedar, as okay. most of our bathrooms are. And then look, here's the. Well, we've got a bar, but I've got a bunch of stuff on it, so it's kind of a mess right now. All right, let me take a and look back here. We'll then we've right. got another bedroom back there. And a... So we made it so we got a shower and the toilet is separate. It's going to be great. Yeah, it be awesome. All right, good job. Well, see. So I used some of the extra concrete for some obstacles here, put some rocks and logs. Here's a marina. So we're working on the boats, we got a concrete poured. Poured all our concrete, this will be a deck and we'll have posts and we'll have kind of a roof over the boats. So how's it going on the... Uh, Concrete removal. The removal is a little sticky, but it's coming out nice and pretty. All right, looks good. So these are all salvage boats. A lot of them come from uh, an insurance auction. They're boats that got uh, loose from the moorings and smashed up a little in different hurricanes and storms. Some up in Minnesota, others in Florida. And uh, we get them for salvage. They're going to be fun cabins. Right. So we got all kind of rigs to drive around, and my favorite is all the military stuff. Hey, Russ, what's going on? Let's go take a little tour. Let's go drive around and see what's happening. Sounds good. All right. Now this is the horse part of the ranch. Call this the love shack. It's down here by the racetrack. So I'm pushing up all these banks quite a bit where people spend hours and hours down here. So I've been pushing out these holes right here, making the banks bigger. So this has got to be my favorite piece of equipment out here. I do the most work with that. I just push dirt and rocks and make fun trails. 
smash over trees and uh, generally love it. All right. So these are our ponds where people can come and picnic and fishing. It's a lot of fun. We're kind of the all-around park. There's something for everybody. So this is our kind of test drive. What I've been doing for years is driving vehicles, running them around and trying to figure out what they need to be fixed. And of course, it's a little tight for me to sit in there, so I've got the new bucket seat to start with. And uh, of course, we left the ignition on, ran the battery down. We got some fuel in there, we charged up. And a little test drive. I think we'll run over the campground and see uh, how it does on the highway. People out here, it's kind of cold. Let's go check our check-in. We got our check-in station. Cook shack. Hey, you getting ready to do a little wheeling? Oh yeah. Oh, here it is, the check-in. How's everything going today? It's been steady. Is it? Yeah. What do you think about the new rig out there? I haven't seen that. Right out there, you gotta take a look. Yeah. So anyway, this is Marisol. She's our check-in agent today. Yeah. Getting it all going on. Please do that for me. Have you been here this year? Uh, it was uh, not 17, no. Did you come this yes, we got saddles for people to sit on. Well, let's try another test drive. You know, it's like any old car, and these are really old. It's going to be going through everything just so it's safe for me to drive because I'm a problem all the time. I'm doing stuff up unless Kelly has it or well, here we are. This is our first Rush Springs Ranch show and go. Here we are. We're at the six car garage, we call it. It's our Repair place and where we keep all our off road rigs. And I got uh, a couple seats in the back for the new 1929 hot rod, rat rod. We're gonna love it. So we're an off road park here. We got all kind of fun vehicles to drive and work with. And we build houses, we cut our own lumber. We got so much fun stuff going on. We're going to have our own TV show. This is it right here, right now.
Hi, I'm Kelly. I'm the mechanic out here at Rush Springs Ranch. We have dozers, tractors, uh, hauling equipment, uh, Oshkosh, um, Stuart Stevenson, uh, to the, all the way down to Chevy pickups. That, uh, we're getting quite a fleet out here, a lot, uh, lot and a lot of equipment. And uh, in this garage behind me, you'll find all kinds of off-road vehicles, ranging from 1929 all the way up to 2016 home-built. A lot of fun out here at Rush Springs Ranch. So here's where all the magic happens. This is a 1931 sitting on a 1975 or 7 Ranger frame, so it's four wheel drive. It's a four wheel drive rig I bought. Need a little bit of work, change it around a little, put a Mercedes diesel engine in there. It's a single seat crawler. Pretty much just drive that one came ready to go and this is a little Tom car running around it's an Israeli Border Patrol vehicle civilian model and look at all this stuff so Kelly stays pretty busy trying to keep it all running luckily we got a lot of stuff so when it breaks Got something else. This is a Unimog engine, actually. And uh, go in that new truck. This is a little golf cart on steroids. Same thing. I'm not too afraid to admit I got a bit of an issue with eBay. Get bored, and if I start drinking, show up the next day with something new. It's all good, though. And this is our kind of new, like, crazy cool toy. <laughs> 29 customized Model A of the 460. This is going to be fun. That's what I got the new seats for right now. I haven't been doing so much with the horses lately, but uh, we do like to ride and do that all once in a while.